everyone, my name is Emily, also known as Kitty Pokemon 87 and welcome back to another Minecraft Hunger Games video. Another wonderful disease of a video to add to the disease of videos that is on YouTube. And today we're going to be playing on Moonbase 9, this time on the Badline SG series. So I, oh, that guy's got a sword and I'm out. I'm out. I am out Magaudi. I am not doing that today. And actually I was going to record this video and I had the hiccups and I'm not kidding you. Some people on my channel actually requested. Now listen, this is a little weird, so close your ears if you're a little sensitive to some weird things. But people actually requested that I do more hiccup videos. Now I don't know what that means, particularly, but I'm assuming that it means they want me to get the hiccups and then record a YouTube video. Now, um, that's, that is very, that is strange. I, I'm not one to judge. But I'm, I'm hardcore judging you. You know who, you know who you are. You know who you are. And I'm just saying, don't post things you wouldn't want your mom to see. And do you really want your mom to know that you, do you, you're asking YouTubers to make videos where they hick? Do you want your mother to find that? Because if so, then, you know, keep, keep posting. You do you. Um, but, uh, but if not... Anyways, so we're gonna get right into the game today. Uh, I actually wanted to get this map because it wasn't, oh man, I'm lagging. <laughs> I'm lagging up a storm up in here. <laughs> uh, I think that guy was like, I don't know, one of us. Um, but I'm actually leaving here, so I'm trying to record as many videos as possible, and they're probably just all gonna be Hunger Games videos because I like to bore you guys. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. I'm in a very weird, jokey mood today, so I'm really sorry if I offend anybody. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know, I don't even know, guys. I'm in, I'm in that kind of mood, you guys know me. I'm a weird person. I, you know what, who am I to judge if you wanna see hiccup videos? I don't even care, you know what? <gasps> I'm just kidding, I would never fake hiccups. That is, that is so stupid, that's like faking an accent on YouTube. I've actually looked it up before. I know there's some guy who goes around on YouTube faking his accent. And that is probably the stupidest thing I've ever heard of. That is literally the, the dumbest thing I've ever, like, what even, why? Who would do that? Like, what even, why? Like, that's like me faking this annoying voice. So, wait a second, I, no, I'm just kidding. We're like, isn't that, isn't that stupid? That's just so stupid, honestly, like, what the heck? But I did want to conduct an experiment and see, see this is my uh, scientific mind speaking here guys. My very intelligent scientific mind. Um, but I want to see um, if two people were to make a channel at the same time about the same thing, making pretty much the same videos, but one was British and one was American, who would get more views? Also I wanted to conduct the same experiment with one who's more considered more attractive than the other. Yada yada yada, you know how the story goes, and I just thought, I think, I just think that's a pretty, now that's a social experiment, that's what I call a social experiment, you see, pretending that you're killing somebody, that's not a social experiment, a social experiment, however, would be, yeah, I, I think I'd consider my YouTube genius idea as a social experiment, because I'm experimenting on society, it's a social experiment. Um, and this is actually an interesting experience. Yeah, I've had this idea for a while, and I think it should be conveyed into an actual thing because I think it'd be really interesting to see. Like, um, do multiple experiments, but then again, it would be kind of hard to do that because then you're just using YouTube as a scientific thing, and I certainly, we certainly don't need any more videos that aren't supposed to be on YouTube. So if we could do this in another way, a similar way, and like make everyone like have people come in and then people watch the videos and then we have the British YouTuber, the less attractive one, blah, 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 blah. And like a, maybe a girl and a guy and see and ask the people uh, varying genders and races and um, ages, uh, see which one they like better. And I think that'd be a very interesting social experience to see by the biased opinions and the not biased opinions and what is more entertaining for people. Uh, it, yeah, I don't know. I just, I just think, I think I'm a genius. I don't know about you guys, but I'm, I'm thinking I'm a genius. Uh, wow, fudge. I just, I just came up with my brilliant idea and you just came in and killed me. It's kind of a, it's kind of a mood, don't you think? You All right, so today I'm feeling particularly edgy. So today I think I'm just going to talk about some topics instead of actually doing a, a Hunger Games video like previously planned. Instead, we are just going to talk about my brilliant idea. Uh, don't forget to leave your opinions in the comments down below. I am, ooh, that guy has a sword. Ha ha ha. Sure hope he doesn't uh, kill me off spawn. XD, please do not. Rar. 
Oh gosh. Oh, uh, but yeah. So yeah, I I don't wanna I don't wanna have to say that whole thing again. So I'm just gonna put that in the video because you know what, guys. Sometimes, uh, it's, uh, sometimes, 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 sometimes you gotta be edgy, and, uh, I'm trying something new. See, you guys don't hate me more than I didn't win the game, right? Because you guys know that obviously I don't win every game, that'd be ridiculous. Let me in! <laughs> oh god, where are the chests in this blasted place? Oh, there's, that guy's got a sword, there's no way that guy does not have a sword. Oh, fudge! Fudge! You're a bad person! You're a bad person. I don't. I dislike you. You're a. I don't like you. Yeah, My we're gonna try this again. Up. Um. So yes. Um. I don't really know what else to talk about now. Uh, now I'm thinking about it. Uh. But I definitely want. Oh baby. Oh baby. Why did I not? No. 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 Stephanie, you're gonna die. I'm sorry, my girl Steph. My girl Kit Kat. I'm sorry. <laughs> Only Cat will get that joke, and uh, hopefully she's watching. Please die. Please do me a favor and die. Mm -mm 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 Mm -hmm. All right, all right, I'm gonna try this, uh, I'm gonna try this one more time, and, uh, if we don't get it, we're gonna call it a video, so, oh, oh, okay, I got it this time, hopefully we can kill X-Snow off spawn, I'm sorry, X-Snow, but it's not Christmas anymore, you should really consider not wearing that skin, because it is not Christmas, and you're really just, oh, wow, I'm lagging a little, <laughs> a little frame lag there, all right, um, we're gonna, are you, oh my gosh, I am not having my weapon out. Uh, you know what? You know what? You know what? You're gonna die. Just because you wanted to attack me, you're gonna die. Because I do not like you. I do not like you. So now I'm playing on Turbulence. I don't really know what to talk about, but I'm just gonna commentate. You know what, guys? A little while ago, uh, I was told by someone. I can't remember who it is. Um... No. Uh, oh yeah, I was told by someone that uh, commentating was a talent. Now I kind of wanted to talk about this a little bit because um, I don't know. Is it like okay? So if you just describe now, we're gonna we're gonna talk about what's commentating, and what's not. So if you just describe okay, commentating originally originated. I actually have no clue. I'm not going to spew out facts that I don't know to be true. But commentating, I think some like commentary over a game probably originated from sports and the sports commentators who commentate on what's happening in the game. So you'd think that YouTube commentators who commentate over gameplay would do the same thing, describe what's happening in the game. And they find that people would find that just as equally as entertaining as people do find sports entertainers. So, or commentators, sorry. And, um, however, I don't find this the same way. Now, I do think that commentating is somewhat of a talent. Some people have it, some people do not. I'm just kidding. You can definitely gain this talent. It's not hard to do. You just have to practice, of course. And I'm not going to pretend like what I'm doing right now, which is talking over some gameplay, is the hardest thing in the world. I'm not going to pretend that I'm going to the moon or, uh, I don't know, building a rocket ship or doing some rocket science or doing some sort of brain surgery or anything. But I'm going to say that it does take talent. Or not talent, sorry, some practice. If you were to go back into my videos a couple of years ago, you would see that obviously my commentary skills have gone up. And obviously you'd want this, am I right? Yes, I'm right. of course you do. Um, and that all comes from the skill of speaking, or speaking skills. Commentary does is a certain speaking skill, I'd say. And though I wouldn't consider myself the most social of pers people, I do consider myself a pretty decent commentator. I can talk, and I think that my talking can be entertaining. And uh, without non-scripted commentary, that is. Um, having the ability to commentate without a script, going scriptless, and having just a few notes in which you could talk about that. And talk about it for a long period of time and not get lost in what you're saying, you know what I'm saying? Not back, or not, um, not digress is what the word I'm looking for. Gosh, I'm just, big kid words today. Um, what else was I saying? Shoot, see now, I'm digressing. Um, but... Yeah, I think that commentary is definitely a skill. A skill, not a talent, a skill. That is exactly the word I'm looking for. Commentary is a skill, and uh, it is practice. And if you look at some YouTubers, and you look at their videos from a while ago, gaming YouTubers, gaming commentators specifically, you will obviously see that their commentating skills have gone up quite a bit, I'd hope. And in the span of a couple years, you can prob probably perfect, almost perfect your commentary skills. Actually, that's not true. Of course, you're always learning. You're never the people who. Hmm, I'm gonna. I know. I heard this. I saw this like quote on like some sort of. Wow, cool. A team. All right, I'm gonna like put that down there. Um, I think my sister's screaming. Why is she screaming? 
Oh, Lush. Um, no. Um, what was I saying? Oh, this guy's gonna die. Um. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yes. Commentary. Um, yes. So, um, to not be distracted easily and just continue to commentate is, um, is also a skill. So, hmm. How would I, how, how can I explain this? But, yeah. Talking, uh, talking about a topic, <laughs> Talking about a topic unscripted for a long period of time is in, is a skill in my mind. And I'd say it's a pretty impressive skill if it is at a certain point of skill level. That makes sense. Um, some people do definitely impress me and I definitely think that my commentary skills will of course go up in the future because I will never stop improving. And you won't either. I think that's also, I don't know who said this, but you... Um, you will never stop Im improving and things, so don't think that you're perfect at doing something because you will never be perfect. You will always start, yeah, you will always be able to prove. There's always room for improvement. So, um, yeah, I don't know, I don't know how the topic of my social experiment came to this, but it did, and that is what we are talking about today. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that little speech about that. Um, but like, but, okay, now, uh, now we're going to talk about a little bit about uh, what I don't think is should be considered commentary. Um, but it is commentary. It By definition, it's commentary. By, by my definition, I wouldn't consider it an impressive commentary. If someone uh, just, you know, ran around uh, with their mic up close doing it. All right, so we're we're going over to the uh, going over to the plane. Oh, got this chance. Nothing in there. Uh, let's keep let's keep going uh, here. Oh, we're going in this little oh crafting table. We needed that. Perfect. We're gonna go ahead and craft a sword. Nice, nice. We got some boots. Oh, I see a team. I think. Oh, we're gonna kind of get out of here. So that is not what I'd consider an impressive commentary because they're just commentating about what's happening in the game. Now, if you were to have a topic to talk about and then you just topic topic said the talk about the topic, that is a that is a better form of commentary. Gosh, I'm not gonna be able to take out the team, so it's gonna be great. So if I die, I'm sorry. Well, at least at least I'll have this this great quality video. Um, but yeah, so that is that is yeah. There's there's lots of different types of commentary, okay? And um, which one? There's more impressive and uh, there's more impressive versions of commentary and less impressive versions of commentary. So if you're just commentating about what's going on in the game, then you know so be it. That is. That is fine. If you want to go around and say, you know, oh, okay, we're going to spawn here. We're gonna we're gonna go ahead and craft a sword. And of course, I do that from time to time. Um, of course, every YouTuber and every gaming commentator will do that from time to time. Um, and sometimes they'll do it the whole video. And I get, that is like that is fine. That is perfectly fine. But personally, I prefer when people have a topic they talk about, and I think it's very impressive that they can play the game and not. Uh, digress from the topic and I think that that is pretty impressive and I think that's a pretty important part of uh, YouTube and I think it really makes a YouTube a very interesting place um, where you can learn these skills and if you watch a lot of commentaries you will um, pick up on some of these skills and you know what again if you practice and if you watch others do it uh, eventually you'll be able to do it too you know you'll be able to you can progress in your commentary skills of course um okay you know what? i'm gonna figure out how i'm gonna take out this team and sometimes when you're focusing on something like example i'm gonna take out this team here i'm gonna try to uh i'm not going to be having such avid commentary as i want to focus on taking out the team and that is perfectly okay in my mind um oh god no i'm not real this <laughs> No, nope, I'm not that good of a gamer, or not good at the Minecraft PvP. -er. Not good in the Minecraft PvP. All right. Uh, okay. Yeah. You know what? 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 If I could take out one of them, that'd be good for me. I'll just take out one of them here. Just kidding. I am just kidding. Well, that was a video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I didn't win, but you know what? Sometimes, if I have a good commentary, 
Uh, nowadays, I'm just gonna put it up because uh, the commentary is more important than the gameplay in my eyes for now. Um, that's what I want my YouTube channel to be about right now, and that's what it's gonna be about. So it goes, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you guys did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Hopefully this team does get defeated in the death match, and if they don't, then uh, whatever, it's okay. Well, uh, whatever, anyways. So if you guys all enjoyed this video, if you guys did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and remember to keep myself. See you guys later. Goodbye.